Adnan's attorney says this is the day Adnan and his family have been waiting for. He is elated, he's joyful, but uh, with so many ups and downs over the past 23 years, right now he's just trying to take it all in. Right now, Adnan's attorney, Erica Suter, says Adnan is just spending time with his family, doing the everyday little things, freedoms many of us take for granted. She says Adnan is incredibly grateful for all of the people who have supported him and believed in him over the years, including his brother, Yusuf Syed. We've been able to hug him, to have him in our house, to talk to him, to see him right in front of us. Well, as for what's next, Suter says Adnan wants to continue his education at Georgetown, something he started behind bars. I know that he's very committed. He was only 17 when he was incarcerated. He was accepted to college. He was really at the precipice of his young life. And I think he wants to, to be able to complete that and to be able to earn his degree. And once he earns that degree, Suter said Adnan wants to go to law school. Suter also said, like all of us, Adnan wants to know what really happened to Heyman Lee and to see her true killer brought to justice. Well, because Adnan is innocent and didn't have any role in this, I think he wants to know, like the rest of us, what really happened. Now, when asked whether Adnan would seek compensation for his wrongful conviction, Suter said that's a question for another day. In the studio, Ashley Hinson, WBAL TV 11 News.